Welcome to the Local Variety Roundup. Here's your host, Rick Summery. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How's everybody doing? I hope you're ready for a great show tonight. Uh, I love being here at New England Tech. Before the show, I actually went to the Tech Diner. I don't know if you can technically call that food, though. <laughs> I, could. I actually had a uh, grilled cheese with bacon and tomato. It was excellent, so big ups to the lady in the blue bandana in the kitchen. Uh, I hope you're ready for a great show. As I said, our first guest is Bon Clogs, who is a Arnold Schwarzenegger enthusiast. So without further ado, Bon Clogs. Bon, I've been a fan for a long time, long oh, yeah? time. So how'd you get into this Arnold Schwarzenegger impression? It's completely spontaneous at first, man. Like, I did it by accident. I hit my thumb <laughs> with a hammer, building a gazebo in my backyard, and screamed like, ah! <laughs> my wife came out and saw, thought she, she saw the governor himself out in my backyard. I don't know. <laughs> Is there any uh, particular movies that influence your craft? Oh, you know, Kindergarten Cop, Total Recall, Terminator <laughs> movies, you know. <laughs> usual stuff that everybody's seen <laughs> pick phrases from. So if you had 10 seconds to speak to Arnold in his voice, what would you say to him? I would say stay in school, don't do drugs, <laughs> and with these together you can achieve greatness. <laughs> That's great. That's great. All Thank right. you for being here. I appreciate oh, thanks that. Thanks for having me. I'm so excited. Okay, we're going to take a commercial break, and we'll be back with a balloon expert when we come back. Seriously, folks, seriously, do not run with scissors. Running with scissors is dangerous. It ruins lives. It destroys communities. And it ends marriages. If you run with scissors, you will likely make a boo-boo, like I did. Welcome back to the Local Variety Show. Our next guest is Larry French. He is a balloon expert. So without further ado, come on out here, Larry. How you doing? Thank you. Nice to see you. How you doing? Doing good. Doing well? Yep. All right, so uh, tell me, tell me, tell me about, how did you get into this balloon expert thing? What, what, is, what, what is it about balloons? Well, you know, balloons is a commune located in southeast France. Oh, is it? Okay. Uh, but they o they're also flexible bags that can be filled up with different types of gases such as mm. helium, hydrogen, nitrous, or air. Mm. Um, but modern balloons are made out of uh, rubber or latex. La I like latex. I but like some latex. of the earlier models were made out of different animal bladders. Animal bladders? That is disgusting, I have to say. But uh, it, do you have any balloons where you could uh, make some animals for the kids? Or <laughs> oh, God, no. I'm allergic to the rubber, so if I ever touch my book my eyes, you know, I just in my room from afar. Okay, all right. Well, you don't have anything? I was under the assumption that you had some type of talent that you could do or... Nope. No. Okay, all right. Uh, our next guest is a local hip-hop genius, Jay Split. So, Jay Split, could you please come out here? Hey, what's going on? I'm doing good, man, but did I really have to follow this clown? Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, bro. I'm not. Okay. <laughs> All right, so uh, how did you get into hip hop? I mean, really, it was it was a girl, you know, I had a crush on this girl. I figured if I showed her I had some skills, you know, write her a little song, mm. you know, maybe she'd go out with me. And I saw I had some skill, and, you know, it's kept going on from there. So did did, the, did she actually? No. Nah. No, she, uh, the girls, they do that. <laughs> No matter, man. I made up for it. So. so, so where do you see your hip hop going in the future? Uh, I see it going far. You know, I'm, I'm trying to evolve it just from hip hop. You know, maybe in the movies. You know, mm -hmm. but you know, I'm trying to do some big things. Trying to have my own record label soon. Mm. You know, make more money from that. Distribute it to the communities. You know, just trying Definitely. to do some good in the world. And so, if you had one type of message that you were trying to show the people, what message would that be? Just be yourself. You don't have to follow everybody. You know. It's a common thing going on. Kids think they gotta be cool, so you know you can be cool. You can you know stay stay in line. So yeah. just trying to just get that across to the youth, really. Mm. 
That's a message that everyone, yep. everyone should listen to. Thank you. Thank you for being on the show. All right, thank you. I'm Rick Summary. This is the Variety Roundup. And stay tuned next week for more talent.